Let's provide a solution given this nice exponential equation, which is 4 raised to power m plus 4 raised to power m. This is equal to 32. So what is the value of m? Okay. So now the solution to this uh, problem. Now we have 4 raised to power m plus 4 raised to power m. This is equal to 32. Okay. Now, as you can see, 4 raised to power m plus 4 raised to power m, actually it's 4 raised to power m is common, okay? So from here, we can just say 1 plus 1, this is equal to 32, okay? Now from here, you're going to have 4 raised to power m multiplied by 2, this is equal to 32, okay? So we divide by 2 here, by 2 here, so that you're going to have 4 raised to power m, this is equal to 16, okay? Now, we have two methods that we can solve for the value of m, okay? So, um, method one, method one is whereby if you have 4 raised to the power m, which is equal to 16, 16 can be expressed as 2 raised to the power 4, okay? And also 4 can be expressed at two, as 2 raised to the power 2, okay? So let's substitute this so that you're going to have 2 raised to the power 2 multiplied by m. This is equal to 2, 2 raised to the power 4, okay? Now from here, if you have a raised to the power n, I'm using the indices identity, raised to the power m, this can be expressed as a raised to the power n multiplied by m, okay? Now that means that this is, this can be expressed as 2 raised to the power 2m, which is equal to to 2 raised to power 4, okay? Now, as you can see, the bases are common here. That is, if you have a raised to power n, this is equal to a raised to power m. And given that the bases are common, the exponent, we just equate the exponent. That is, n is equal to m. So let's use this property so that you're going to have 2 raised to power 2m this is equal to 2 raised to the power 4, and that means that 2m is equal to 4, okay? So we divide by 2 both sides, so that m is equal to 2, okay? So this is the value of m, okay? So this is method 1, okay? So this is method 1. Let me take you through method 2 as follows. Now, since you have solved using method 1, let me show you how to solve the value of m using method 2, okay? Now, as you can see, 4 m raised to power, uh, 4 raised to power m plus 4 raised to power m is equal to 32, and 4 m is common. So, as obvious, we're going to, I mean, to equate to that 2. So, that means that 4 raised to power m multiplied by 2, this is equal to that 2. So, divide by 2, divide by 2, okay? So, we're going to have 4 raised to power m this is equal to 16, okay? Now, to solve for the value of m, we introduce the natural logarithm such that we're going to have log 4 raised to the power m. This is equal to log 16, okay? And we're saying that 4 can be expressed as 2 raised to the power 2, okay? And 16 can be expressed as 2 raised to the power 4, okay? So let's substitute this. We're going to have log 2 raised to the power 2m, this is equal to log 2 raised to the power 4, okay? Now from here, applying the logarithm identity, that if you have log a raised to the power n, this can be expressed as n log a, okay? So let's apply this property so that we're going to have 2m log Two, this is equal to 4 log 2, okay? So this is the exponent 4 comes, uh, we'll have 4 log 2 as, of, of, as you apply this identity so that you're going to have, we divide by log 2 both sides, okay? We divide by log 2 both sides so that you're going to have 2m, this is equal to 4, okay? So we simplify here so that we're going to have the value of m as equal to 2, okay? Now from here, 
let's verify let's verify that the value of m satisfies the equation okay remember as you can recall we end for raised to power m plus 4 raised to power m this is equal to that too okay which you can which you can be able to express it as 4 raised to power m this is equal to 16. so let's see if we substitute the value of m which is 2 if the value will be equal to 16. so if you say 4 raised to power 2 this is the same this will be equal to 16. so if you say 4 squared this is equal to 16 which is equal to 16. and that verifies that the value of m which is equal to 2 satisfies the equation so thank you for watching and kindly subscribe